What's up, man? So I would say that the biggest glaring thing in that whole email that you sent me, uh, the biggest thing is, you know, you are trying to lose weight, you're trying to lose fat, you're trying to keep muscle. You mentioned cortisol, stress, and your testosterone levels. Um, the number one thing, the most important thing when it comes to doing what you want to do that you didn't make any mention of at all is your nutrition and your diet and whether or not you're in a deficit or not and what your macros look like, what your calories look like, what your diet looks like. Um, I think you will find that that is the missing piece to your puzzle, um, putting more emphasis on that as opposed to hormones. Um, hormones play a huge role, but you know, with regards to the hormones that you're talking about, calories, macros are going to be way more important for what you want to do. Something else that you need to consider is how lean do you actually want to get? Like, you mentioned a body weight goal. But that doesn't really mean much of anything you know, like if you're 30% body fat right now at 250 pounds and you want to get down to 220, you know, I mean, is that a body fat percentage that you think you would want to be? Like, what do you want to look like physically? How lean do you want to be, you know? Um, because I think you might be very much overestimating how much muscle you actually have, considering you've basically been natural up to this point, based on what you've said. And based on what you didn't say about your nutrition, I feel that that is going to be um, the number one thing. I do not think that you should add in carnitine. I think that you absolutely can make all the progress that you're looking for through a nutrition program. Um, you've been a, with a personal trainer for the last six years and you feel like you haven't made any progress the last two. Does your personal trainer know anything about nutrition? When I was personal training... You know, I did one-on-one -on -one training for 10 years. And the thing that got clients the best results, the results that they actually wanted, had nothing to do with our training. It had nothing to do with what went on inside the gym. It had nothing to do with how many sets, reps, how hard we pushed, how many burpees we did, you know. It had nothing to do with any of that. And the vast majority of clients just want to lose weight. They just want to get lean. That has very, very little to do with training and everything to do with nutrition. That was probably one of the biggest reasons that I was a very busy trainer was because... I would help my clients out with nutrition and put a huge emphasis on that side of things. And that's what got my clients results. The training is in place to prevent muscle from being lost. But the nutrition side of things helps that even more and helps stimulate all the fat loss.
So yeah, what I would say you need to do is number one, figure out a realistic goal and, and be able to visualize exactly what you want to look like and be able to see that, like find a picture of it. What are you, what is your goal? And whatever that is, that's great. Like whatever you want, that's, that's the most important thing is being able to visualize exactly what you want to look like. Because if you can't visualize that, if you can't see the end goal, that makes it extremely hard to get to it. So take some time to figure out exactly what you are looking for in your physique that you think at this point in your life you would be extremely satisfied with. So do that. And then from there, you'll have a better idea of how much you need to weigh and what body fat percentage that might be. And then the next thing is make sure that your nutrition program is set up to get you to that place. Being on steroids, being on a super physiological dose of steroids, you know, I mean, you're doing what, four, 400 to 500 milligrams of test a week. Um, like that's going to maintain all the muscle that you currently have. Um, but yeah, it's not going to lean you out. It's not going to help you lose more weight. If anything, it's going to put fat weight on you. So highly recommended that you start working on your nutrition side of things. Um, or if, you know, talk, talk to your personal trainer about it. If they know anything about anything, they will be all over that. Um, and if they don't, you know, and you don't know what to do with regards to nutrition, you know, um, you figure that out. <laughs> it's a huge deal. Huge, huge deal. I I've made many videos talking about, you know, how to set up a meal plan and, and whatnot. I mean, I do have um, a macro calculator on my website for sale that sets up all of your meals for you based on your body weight. And it's built to get someone lean. Um, so there's an option for you there if you're not sure what to do. Um, some other options that I think are good is you could go and search YouTube for uh, the vertical diet and follow my vertical diet blueprint video. Um, that's a pretty easy way to set up the vertical diet, which is a pretty popular, easy to do plan. Um, then watch the vertical diet made easy videos that I've put out um, because it just simplifies things even more. And yeah, man, nutrition, nutrition. And I only say all of this because not one, there was not one point in that email, in that long email that had anything to say about nutrition. And that's a red flag to me. So I hope this helps.